Nano Dimensions or NNDM stock is reaching new crazy high levels and we are getting very close to the $10 a share mark. Why is it going up so much and why do I think that it still has a long way to go and is undervalued? I will be explaining a bunch of bullish points for this company as well as some recent developments so make sure to stay around and watch until the end so you don't miss anything here. Last time I talked about this company it was at the $6 levels and I was sure that it would very soon recover from the last drop and jump to new all time highs. And lo and behold it did. At the time of this video it is above $9 a share and congratulations to all of those investors who were holding on to this stock and enjoyed the run up. Even if you didn't though I think this stock still has massive upside potential and let me tell you why. For those who don't know, this company provides 3D printing machines that can be used with semiconductors and other advanced electronics. Their technology is really one of a kind and completely different from their competitors. Through strong software and AI technology, they can actually bridge the gap between drawing and virtually creating your desired component in their software to actually physically printing it out. And they can do this very quickly, mind you. So now let's get into all the reasons I just think this stock is undervalued. Firstly, these guys have a very low market cap in relation to just how big of a market they will be operating in in the future, even after the recent massive run-up we've seen. They are barely about $1 billion in market cap. That is really low when you one, look at how much Nano Dimension was affected by the economic downturn of this year and still managed to deliver nice revenues, and two, when you consider that the global 3D printing market is estimated to be worth around $3 billion in just about 5 years. Right now, Nano Dimension is mostly working in the aerospace and defense industries, along with various academic applications, but the potential here is endless. Right now, 99% of the world's hearing aids are made and customized to perfection through 3D printing. But in the future, everything from pacemakers and various implants to knee and hip replacements can be made through 3D printing technology. As I said earlier, the academic institutions are also making more and more use of 3D printers now, and very soon I think this will be a course in itself. Apart from this, there are an infinite number of applications in manufacturing and construction. There are so many components and parts that would benefit massively from being customized through 3D printing that it makes me wonder just how big this market can become in the future. And Kathy Woods, the CEO of ARK Invest, totally agrees with this. She says in a recent webinar along with another analyst, Tasha Keeney, that Nano Dimension is very unique and that there is nobody else doing what they are doing. They also talked about how these guys are much more than just a 3D printing company. The way they bridge the gap between virtual design and actual physical printing with the help of AI technology should really set them apart from all the other competitors. For those who don't know, by the way, ARK Invest is a famous and very successful investment fund who prides themselves on investing in disruptive and sustainable innovation that makes the world a better place. At this point, these guys own $35 million worth of shares in Nano Dimension, which is a lot if you consider the size of the company, and they just keep on buying more and more shares every single week. So with a company like this being bullish on Nano Dimension, that just makes me more confident that they are a good investment. Keep in mind guys that ARK Invest has an actual team of professional analysts that do this for a living and if they keep buying more and more shares of Nano Dimension then it is in my opinion very likely that it is a good stock and worth getting into. So with all this said, what share price do I see for Nano Dimension in the future? I really think these guys will surprise the market next year when they are no longer held back by a pandemic. They are in the early aggressive growth phase right now and I am confident that they will be able to take a lot of market shares in the 3D printing space in the future. I think it is only a matter of time before we break that $10 a share barrier and as we get deeper into the next year I see share prices of $20 to $30 being reached. 
If you decide to get into this stock though, you better make sure not to panic sell the second it goes down. Stocks like these are very volatile and you need to hold them for the long term if you really want to see them grow and reflect the company's actual fundamentals. As always guys, again, if you decide to buy this, make sure to not go all in on this with your money because the stock market is simply risky in nature. Diversify your portfolio and own many different stocks so you never go bankrupt if one single stock wouldn't go as planned. And even though I am clearly bullish on now dimension, make sure to do your own research on the stock and make your own decisions since I am not a financial advisor and this is not financial advice, but rather entertainment. And with that, I want to conclude today's video. If you are new here, by the way, my name is Sam and welcome to the channel. Here I talk about various different growth stocks and my opinions on them. I like to mainly focus on stocks that are disruptive and sustainable that I think are important for the future. Also, I'd like to see them have massive upside potential before going into them. Anyways, if you enjoyed this video, make sure to press that like button to help us reach out to more people about Now Dimension or MMDM stock and simply show them the case of the company and the pros and cons of it. Again, clicking that like button is the absolute best way you can support me. Also, if you have watched all the way to this point and if you enjoy the content, of course, then why not subscribe to the channel and join our rapidly growing community. We are so close to getting to that 10,000 investor mark and I am just so very appreciative of your support. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video.